one, continuing our reviews of productivity apps on the iPad, I'm going to walk you through an app called Totally Do, which is a high scoring productivity app and to do list manager on the iOS platform. When you log into Tootly Do, uh, what you're going to do is be presented with this screen, which is a very simple way of looking at tasks. Um, again, as a task and to-do management app, it's very focused on making sure that you can quickly and easily access your tasks, add documentation if need be, and make any changes to the system. That being said, uh, what I'm going to do is go ahead and walk you through the process of adding a task and the key features that you have so that you can see what it's like to use Totally Do. First off, I'm going to go ahead and add a task, and we're going to call this test just like normal. And we're going to add it. Once it's added, it, go, it populates into my important task list. Um, the general idea is that all of the tasks that you add are important to some degree. If I select that task, I can add additional notes, I can edit it, and I can change its priority from within the app to having high priority, low priority, medium priority, etc. I can also set a due date for reminders of when this is due. I can set a due time so that I have the exact date. I can organize all of my to-do lists into folders if I choose. And one of the nice features is being able to set an alarm with an every X day notification. So you can set something up to be every five days, every three days, however that works for you. The last feature is an alarm so that you can set up a notification within Tootly Do uh, if you want to know when things are coming. Um, you can set that up to a month in advance uh, to give you a little bit more time on your projects. This does sync uh, with the Tootly Do servers so that you will have one to-do list across all of your iOS devices. In terms of to-do apps, I find this one a little bit clunky. It has a lot of the bells and whistles that we're looking for in a to-do app, uh, but it's missing some of the aesthetic decisions that we find in apps like Trello or Todoist or things of that nature. Um, so I end up using other apps uh, such as Neo when I am managing my own personal to-do list. Um, this is another great one in the chain. If you want something that's very simple and very powerful for organizing simple to-do lists um, within your own digital life. Again, this is another review in the productivity series. Keep an eye out for more productivity apps and reviews as time goes on. And we look forward to seeing you around more and more.